All right, today I have a Tefal Air Max fan, and I'm going to show you how to use this Tefal Air Max fan. All right, so right here is the Tefal Air Max fan, if you didn't know, if I didn't mention it before. And so in order to use this, there's a couple of ways that you can uh, function this fan. That didn't make any sense, but I'm going to get to it. All right, so right here. So there's a lever right here. I'm gonna go over what this does right here. I'm gonna go over the power switch in the back and the fan speed on the front. Now, the first thing you wanna do is make sure that the fan is plugged in, all right? So once you have it plugged in, if you look on the back of this particular fan, you'll see that there is a switch right here. And this switch right here is the power switch. All right, this is the full power switch right here. There is, if you look in closer, I don't know if you can see that, but it's a straight line, and that is the side that indicates the power is on. That right here is where the circle is in right here. If you have it switched to the left, that is the power is off. So I'm going to switch to the right. The power is on. So you're wondering why the fan isn't going right now. Well, I'm going to explain that to you. All right, so you're going to go to the front of the fan, and then you're going to get down to the flow, all the way down to the flow. Well, not really flow, I just try to be cool when I said that. So, you're gonna be right here, and you see it says T-Fall Air Max, and it is currently off. Now to turn it on, go right there, it goes on to that. It's at a low speed, go to that, see it's two, that is a little bit faster, do that, that is three. Now you have that on, there is another feature, and it's called osculating. In order to do that, you can come up to here, and on the back of the fan, you'll see that there is this switch right here. And if you push it down, the fan starts osculating. You see that? It starts osculating. And it keeps on going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Now, to get that to stop, you're going to come back over here, and you're going to pull this up. And whatever direction it is when you pull it up, it will stay in that direction and keep on blowing. Now to turn it off, you just simply go down here and the fan is off. But the main power switch is still on, so you can go like this. So that is how you operate this T-Fall fan, this T-Fall Air Max fan. Now it's important that you read the owner's instructions so you know exactly how to use this T-Fall Air Max fan. You know exactly how they intended for you to use it. This is just a guide. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope this is helpful.